The data comes down from these tiny little chips on these yellow cables through these tiny little wires that go all the way to the bottom of the screen. So the image data is sent to the screen one row at a time. So row one gets turned on, then it gets filled with image data. Row two gets turned on, then filled with image data, and it goes all the way down to the bottom of the screen and then back up to the top. The filling up and refreshing of the rows of the image data happens so fast you don't even notice it. Instead, you see a moving picture. But with a camera, it looks like these dark lines are moving up. I need to take you in closer to explain what you're seeing here. When you zoom in really close, you can see the rows of red, green, and blue pixels, or sometimes they're called subpixels. It's the combination of these three colors and their intensity levels that are mixed together to produce the desired colored pixel. You may or may not know that an LCD works based on light polarization. The liquid crystals are actually changing shape in order to polarize the light from zero to 90 degrees to get the desired intensity. So when I say image data, I'm talking about the voltage applied to the liquid crystal to get it into the desired shape. And again, it's more complicated